I welcome you to Meza Revelation Ministry. Uh, if you are watching uh, this video for the first time, we are an end time prophetic ministry and we focus on end time events. As part of our ministry, we also um, alert you about false prophets uh, who in the last days will lead people astray. And today's video, we are focusing on um, the three days of darkness. Three days of darkness. I've been watching um, a lot of uh, YouTubers and they have been talking about three days of darkness. And the three days of darkness, according to them, uh, are three days that are coming and there will be darkness all over the world. And um, they are saying that uh, when the darkness comes, nobody should go out. And they are giving instructions of what people uh, should do when uh, the three days of darkness come in. Um, I, I felt that I have to um, come out to do a video on the so-called three days of darkness. Um, enough is enough. Uh, because a lot of people are misleading uh, Christians. They are misleading uh, the world. And they are also blaspheming uh, the name of the Lord uh, with uh, the so-called uh, visions and prophecies about uh, the three uh, days of darkness. Now, I know one YouTuber, um, she has made a lot of videos on the, on the so-called three uh, uh, days of darkness. Uh, almost in her YouTube career, I believe that uh, one third of her uh, videos uh, about um, the three days of darkness. Uh, she claims that it has been revealed to her uh, that um, there will be three uh, days of darkness. Um, uh, the, uh, and she has made a lot of videos about, about it. Um, according to her, uh, it was revealed to her by God that there will be three days of darkness. In March 2021, uh, I watched a YouTube and it was brought to my attention by one of the members of this channel. And if I'm not mistaken, uh, the channel name is called Panuel Ngondi. I'm not sure whether I'm saying it right. And I watched the video and in the video, the presenter said that there is going to be three days of darkness um, beginning in uh, beginning on 4th of April to the 7th of April 2021. So in March, uh, I was expecting um, uh, three days of darkness. Uh, de definitely, I didn't, I didn't believe there would be three days of darkness, but the person making the presentation said that uh, he had a visitation from God. He had a visitation from God and God directly told him that there will be three days of darkness beginning on 4th of April 2021 to the 7th of April 2021. And when I watched the video, um, I had a lot of um, concerns. Did God actually uh, visit him? Did he have a visitation from God? Um, I'm not sure. Uh, yeah, I was wondering in my mind, did he actually have visitation from God? Number two, um, even if he had a visitation from God, did God tell him that there will be three days of darkness beginning uh, on the 4th of April 2021? Um, he set a date. So the member of this channel who forwarded the video to me I re responded that um, I cannot deny or confirm whether there will be three days of darkness, but I was concerned that the person is setting a date. And that is very serious because if you set a date and it doesn't come in, then you are a false prophet. And so whoever made the video and said, uh, God told him there will be uh, three days of darkness beginning on April the 4th, 2021. That person is a false prophet based upon Deuteronomy 
chapter 18 verse 22 if a prophet who calls himself a prophet says a, um, a prophecy um, that doesn't come true then that prophecy was not from God and that person is a false prophet uh, this person was saying God visited him and as he was making the video he was crying tears uh, were coming from his eyes uh, it means that he was very sad um, he was sad because he was uh, delivering a, a serious message that um, there will be darkness all over the world beginning 4th April 2021 and lo and behold um, at the time of making this video we've passed April 4th we've passed uh, April 10th and uh, today is April 10th and nothing has happened so that's why I'm making this video you have to be very 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 skeptical about people who claim to have had visions and who claimed that the Lord is speaking to them oh the Lord told me oh I asked the Lord and the Lord told me there's one youtuber who has made so many videos on the three days of darkness and in March she made a video the upcoming three days of darkness so probably she was expecting that um, you know people would believe her and when 4th April came in 7th April came in and nothing happened she made another video and said that we are not yet out of the woods the three days of darkness are coming in so easter has come april has come and they are saying that the three days of darkness will come in april so i i predict that in the year 2022 if we are still alive uh, they will still um, talk about three days of darkness and if it doesn't come in the year 2023 they will still be talking about uh, three days of darkness you have to remember Jesus told us in Matthew 24 verse 4 that in the last days people will deceive and there are so many false prophets and false prophetess on the YouTube who are misleading people with the so-called false visions and false uh, prophecies about the so-called uh, three days of darkness don't let uh, don't let me um, uh, mislead you here um, I cannot say that there's no three days of darkness because the Lord can do whatever he wants to do um, there were three days of darkness in the in the Old Testament and people are focusing on that in 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 prophesying that there will also be another three days of uh, darkness coming and what is wrong with them is that they are setting dates and when the dates come nothing happens and so they are blaspheming the name of the Lord by associating the name of the Lord with their false visions and their false prophecies about the so-called three days of darkness. Would there be darkness in the world? Obviously, yes. If you read Zephaniah chapter 1 verse 18, uh, there is a day that is coming, it will be gloomy, uh, uh, there will be darkness. If you read Joel, uh, a, a day is coming when the moon will not show its light, the sun will not show its light, but they are all apocalyptic, ap apocalyptic events that are coming. That doesn't mean that um, uh, there is um, going to be a three days of darkness that will come on a certain date. Uh, Sephania didn't set a date. Joel didn't set a date. Uh, Amos didn't set a date. And if you set a date that there will be three days of darkness and you associate the name of the Lord to that uh, date and it doesn't come true, if you are a woman, you are a false prophetess. If you are a man, you are a false prophet. So the conclusion of this video is that all those people who prophesied that there will be three days of darkness beginning on April the 4th, 2022, 
2021 to April the 7th, 2021. You are false and you are false prophet and you should re repent. And if you continue making videos just yes, because you want people to have um, watch your videos and get more views and profit uh, for monetization, uh, please repent because your judgment is uh, coming. So this video is a lesson that don't let false prophets and false prophetess deceive you with their false visions about the so-called three days of darkness. Beware. This is Messiah Revelation Ministry. And the fact that people are using the name of the Lord uh, to predict um, the coming three days of darkness and certain dates, it tells you that we are approaching the end times. We are in the end times. And that's what makes it more important for you to accept the Lord now and know that the Antichrist using um, his agents uh, making false prophecies and they are blaspheming the name of the Lord by associating the Lord with the false prophecies about the so-called three days of darkness. Thank you.